uh, been kind of under the weather. Um, it's crazy, right? I gotta preach tonight. <laughs> I'm still gonna preach like a, uh, a mad woman, amen. You know, I'm not, I'm not gonna hold back. Uh, so we're excited. We're gonna go to Morrisville School of the Prophets. Um, it has been intense the uh, opposition, but that's just a sign that God is gonna do something great tonight. And just for this whole conference, people came all over the globe: Utah, Nevada, Texas, Mississippi, the Carolinas, all over New York for this meeting to receive something from God. So I just thank God that I'm able to be there. So I'm going to teach these people everything I know on the prophetic. So I'm excited about that. So I'm going to take my ther my ther flu because last night all I did was cough, 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 cough. I didn't get much sleep because I kept coughing. I'm like, oh my God, like, you know, so I'm just trying to drink this warm liquid because it soothes my throat. And we're going to pack. Um, I got to finish packing the kids' stuff. Pack my stuff because you know I'm a last-minute packer, right, you guys? I don't know about you guys, but I, I'm a last-minute packer. So I'm just trying to get the kids' lunch together. You know what they have in their lunch. They have, like, cheese, crackers. They have, like, fruit roll-ups, stuff like that. I don't know if you guys... Pack your kids' lunch, but uh, that's what we do. What else they have in their lunch? Sometimes I put little raisins in there. Yeah. What else I want to put today? Today I'm going to put. They have like little juice boxes. If I can find the juice boxes they like. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Sometimes I put little fruit cups in their lunch boxes. Let me bend down here and grab some chips. You know, um, some chips in there. Yeah. yeah. Get some Cheetos today and find the Dorito. Doritos. Yep. One kid like pepperoni sandwiches. The other kid like ham sandwiches. All right. So team with cheese. My mom said cheese okay so today we're gonna have a giveaway you know cuz we love you guys me and Bay talk about this is actually his idea you know one of the things of this ministry is I always give away stuff amen and babe he he's a giver too he has a heart to give so he wants to give away his book today who touched me so ding 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 it's time for trivia you know, for the first person that can tell me, guys, on the comment section, what is Babe's favorite meal? First person commented in the comment section below. You guys, you will get a copy of Who Touched Me? My Journey to Jesus. All right. So we're going to be having uh, four more giveaways for you guys. Amen. So I'm excited. So yeah, let me get in here. Uh, you know, I got tons of onions. <laughs> yeah, so apples. Look at some apples today in the kids lunch. They like that. All right, they like that. So,
What's up, team? As you can see, we eating our breakfast. Got roasted vegetables, leftover from last night. Babe made some more tilapia. Hooked us up with a salad. And she got some corn with hers. Ain't make me no corn. That's all right, Tim. Got a good wife. She feed her man. It's good, babe. Let me pat you on your back. <laughs> babe not feeling too well, but I'm sure she, she told y'all. I want her coughing on my food. How <laughs> bad I love you. <laughs> you know, you gotta put Chuck your stuff. <sighs> Tell you, trying to be flying. What do you hate when you're eating? But you might just steady talking to you. And you see stuff flying. Well, you at a restaurant sitting down and somebody you know come talk to you and talk over you. I take care of my bag. I guess I got to do all the driving. You feel like driving today? No, no, shout out. If y'all seen We're Still Alive, you know what I'm talking about. That's right, I'll drive. What's up, team? So, it's been a long drive. About a, uh, been on the road since like one o'clock. Here in my room, the room is awesome. Babe is about to eat and I gotta get ready. I gotta put on my makeup and get my dress out of my clothes and get ready to go downstairs, set up my books and everything like that. So you guys, yeah, wanna get some coffee because Prophet is, is exhausted. But I'm gonna show you guys what they did for us. So you guys, they gave us an awesome basket. There's some good stuff in here too. Yeah, it's really good, good, good stuff in here. Yeah. Um, really nice snacks. I see some good stuff in here. I hook this up. I got water. I got some good old yummies in here. But this is our room. Got a nice microwave. Let's see what's in here. Yeah, good things. We got a fridge. All right, so this is the thing. I don't know if y'all can see. But yeah, we got a TV. That. Nice. That. We got beds. I did last week. The enemy tried everything he could do to stop me. You know, whenever you do something great for God, get ready for some, uh, you know, demonic oppression, some resistance. See, the enemy doesn't want you to walk into your calling. The enemy doesn't want you to walk into your destiny. He'll try to stop you. He'll try to discourage you. He'll try to get you, you know, down on your feet. He wants you to quit. But I'm talking to some people tonight that say, I'm not going to quit. Amen. I'm talking to some people tonight that says I have tenacity. A mind that's made up to fight. Yeah. Who am I talking to tonight in this room? Amen. 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 Come on now. Who knows that you are going to come out victorious? Amen. 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 Who's going to come out victorious? Amen. 
Yes. So let's wipe your pretty eyes. Amen. Let's see some people got makeup on or whatever. Amen. And just let's just get ready to receive. So let me go ahead and pull up my notes. Amen. So y'all bear with me. <clears throat> and we try to attack, like like I said, I had a cold. I'm like, what? Really? I got sick. On the night I'm supposed to be preaching. So we're gonna be we're gonna talk about this thing tonight. Amen, amen. amen. So what is prophetic warfare? All right, it's the Hebrew word, Tashaba. All right, let's break that down. T S A B A, Hebrew word. Amen. Tashaba. And it sound fancy to learn some Hebrew tonight. All right, <laughs> secret of mine. I got a good Bible, a good. What's up, team? So up, team? I'm tired. I'm tired too. <laughs> yeah, my face breaking out, y'all. My face breaking out too. I'm about to sit up here and eat this pizza. We preached today. Uh, we did prophetic activations. It was awesome. People were prophesying and stuff. Yeah, thank God. People got healed tonight. Yeah. It's like 11 o'clock. You know, my services be long, but it's, I give this Holy Spirit room to move. So, anywho, we'll talk about prophetic war warfare. Um, Babe is drinking my lemonade. Be sweet, our lemonade, yeah. Um, yeah, we got a nice room. The hospitality is amazing. Um, Apostle Cox, his wife, um, Prophetess Cox. I'm <laughs> sorry, y'all. I got, <coughs> I got a cough. <coughs> yeah, I'm getting over a cold. I mean, I still preached with a cold and laid hands of prophesy. That's like the enemy is not gonna stop me from flowing. Anywho, y'all, I got a long day in the morning. Um, I gotta teach two classes tomorrow. So, yeah, I'm about to eat this pepperoni pizza. And take my clothes and put my pajamas on and get some rest. I love you guys. Thank you for joining us on this journey.